A Minnesota-based business is celebrating a partnership that is bringing its language games to more shelves this holiday season and beyond. Nashke Native Games, founded by local educator Tony Drews, aims to make entertaining games that are focused on teaching and preserving the Ojibwe language and culture. WCCO web producer Cole Primo spoke with the founder on Nashke's mission, the partnership that's bringing one of its games to a wider audience and more. Buju, miwao chanodin, Tony Drews nindijinakaz. Egaye gagasqua jemikog nindun jaba nimain nindudim. So my name is Tony Drews, and I'm the founder of Nashke Games. My Ojibwe name is Chinodin, which means big wind. I'm from Leech Lake, and I am from the Sturgeon Clan. So Nashke Games, if you look Nashke up in the dictionary, you'll see behold. Look, check us out. So that's why we went with that. And then we took our original uh, images from our, our first teachers, the petroglyphs. So that's that's where our branding comes from. I was working in the Indian education program with youth, realizing that their um, knowledge of Ojibwe language and culture uh, wasn't where that maybe it should have been for these young Ojibwe children. And teaching it on the chalkboard just was going nowhere. So we developed these games to uh, teach and excite our Ojibwe youth of their uh, Ojibwe Ijitwawan, their culture and their language. In addition to finding our games on our website, we have paired with different community organizations to sell our games as well. Uh, you can check out Birchbark Books and uh, Blue Hummingbird Woman has some of our games. We are super excited about the relationship that we have with Games by James. Um, our mission is to increase awareness and empower learning of the Ojibwe language. And Games by James has really got behind our mission and has our games, our Benatia game, which is our take on goldfish. And you learn 24 different names of our winged relatives and a very common um, conjugation of the word wabum, to see someone. For language learners, we can use this game to uh, practice the, that conjugation and other conjugations of different seeing different people. You can find our games and games by James in their Mall of America store, St. Cloud, Minnetonka, uh, Southdale, and Eclair stores. We are super excited that our games have got the attention that it has. And when we do game events and we see the excitement, not only in our youth, but our adults and our elders, it brings so much joy to us. We're doing this because our language is in trouble. There's under a thousand first language speakers in the United States and um, <clears throat> the language learners that are not replacing those first language uh, learners by any means. So we're, we're in trouble. Um, but when our youth are playing these games, they're exposed and they're learning and they're having fun and it builds to their native identity. When I was working with youth in the school district, they were very proud to be native. But then when we started getting down to, to conversations, they really weren't aware of what they were proud of. But through these games, build their native identity and um, gives them a reason and how they can articulate why they are proud to be Ojibwe. Our games are all meant to be played in English. They can all be played in English. We provide the tools to be able to play most of our games all in Ojibwe. And it's not a real big lift. Um, some of our games, just up to four words, you can play the whole game in Ojibwe. Uh, I'm Ojibwe, so that's my 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 sweet spot, so that's my lane. Um, but we have talked to different communities that are interested in uh, working with us to expand our games into other languages, uh, such as Dakota. Nashke Native Games will also be releasing a new game soon called Gi Wayne, which is a cross between Sorry and Trouble. That's slated to be available by the new year. A portion of Nashke Native Games profits are donated to Native youth in scholarships and other investments in the Native American community. You can find out more information at nashke.com.